Okay, just want to make a quick video. Anyone struggling with the PS4 hard drive upgrade, if you've got the old 500 gigabyte and you need more space, so you've got to upgrade to the one gig, uh, sorry, the one terabyte or the two terabyte hard drive. Now, I've just recently been struggling with this myself. I've literally not an hour ago just done it. So, what the problem was, for me at least, and I'm sure for most of you, is you're going on the website, <coughs> you're going down to the perform an installation of the system software. I'm sure you've already all been told. You've made your USB subfolders. You've downloaded this one, this link right here, which is around, yeah, it should be, as I say, I've downloaded it a couple of times in frustration. Um, it's around 800 megabytes, 850 megabytes. And I'm sure what you've done is you've plugged it into your PS4 and then you get this code. And it says you cannot find the file update. <coughs> now what the problem is, and the solution to fix it, so if you go pop your hard drive back into your PC as I have and then you go onto your uh, PC and then you find your USB now as you see I've got more than a gigabyte of space which is all you need just double check your format I'm sure you've already all been through this I'm sorry FAT32 yeah obviously right now you go into your subfiles you got PS4 and then you got update now what I have here is I have the PlayStation Update and I have it saved twice. Now one of these is named wrong and the other one is named right. You look over here it says type. Both are put files. Now the PlayStation website, when you click this link, it downloads the file as a put file. So people on the internet are telling you to make your subfolders, you PS4 and then you update subfolders. And they're telling you to name this update ps4update.pup. Right, here's the problem. If you right click now, go into properties and details, look at the name of the file. It says right here ps4 update.pup.pup. Now, that's why your PlayStation won't recognize the file and has .pup twice. So, the solution to fixing this is simply call it ps4 update. Don't put the dot and don't put the pup. Now, if you right click this, properties and details, Look at the name of the file now, ps4update.pub. I realized this <clears throat> after trying multiple times, quite frustrating. And I tried this, I deleted that one. I've only just made this copy now for this video, but I deleted that one and I put the PS4 update in this subfolder as PS4 and update. Now I've already upgraded my um, PlayStation, so I can't unfortunately show you it working, but I promise you it does work. Just make sure that when you uh, put your PlayStation into safe mode, you go down to option seven, which is the um, ins which is the reinstall of the um, system installation. Or oh, I can't remember fully what it's called, but it's option seven, the very bottom one on the list. I plugged my USB in, and it worked first time. As soon as I clicked it, it started initializing. I couldn't believe it. It was absolutely gobsmacked. It does work. It's just um, I don't know why people are saying put dot pop in a name. You don't need to. If you've got this far and it's not working and you're scratching your head saying, oh, there's no spaces in between, trust me, I can't show you. I feel quite guilty not being able to show you, but to take my word for it, PS4 update without the dot, without the pub. I hope this helps, guys. I know it certainly helped me at least, so I'm sure if it's worked for me, it'll work for many others. All right, thanks for watching.